from the 22 News Broadcast Center. This is 22 News at 530. Lottery players across the country and here in western Massachusetts are dreaming about potential riches with the multi-state Mega Millions jackpot now at a record $540 million. Dollars. Good evening. Welcome to 22 News at 530. I'm Laura Hutchinson. I'm Ryan Walsh. Just one day left to dream about what you would do with more than a half a billion dollars. I can come up with a half a billion ideas, that's for sure. The Mega Millions drawing is tomorrow night, and lots of people are picking their numbers in hopes of a win. But as 22 News reporter Jackie Brousseau explains, how you pick your numbers might not make a difference. I just decided to grab some quick picks for the Mega Millions this week. The $500 million jackpot for the multi-state lotto game has many people hoping they are holding the lucky numbers. So how do people pick their numbers? Gilbert Perlman goes with quick picks for a reason. I feel that the human mind puts patterns and stuff into numbers that the computer doesn't. And if the computer picks the number as a quick pick, I should too. Hmm. Putting that much thought into it might not matter. According to Western New England University Associate Professor of Mathematics, David Mazur, how you pick your numbers makes no difference. Your numbers, whichever numbers that you decide to play, are uh, just have the, the same chances as coming up as um, any group of numbers in the computer. So you should be equally happy playing your numbers versus um, taking the quick pick. Still, everyone has a strategy. I've had no luck with the birthdays or anything like that, so <laughs> quick picks usually I do a little bit better. But Mazur says instead of looking at how you choose numbers, you might want to hear what you have a better chance at doing. Get this, you have a better chance of flipping a penny and having it land on heads 27 times in a row than winning the Mega Millions. It's $500 million. It's, it's a chance. In Chicopee, I'm Jackie Brousseau for 22 News.